A look at this video capturing a car crashing through an Italian restaurant in Gwinnett County. Luckily, no one was injured, although the damage is extensive. Atlanta News First Blake Devine talked to the owner. Blake joins us live with the latest out on Rockbridge Road. And Blake, what does it look like out there now? Chelsea, not exactly a normal night to eat out here. The staff was picking up the pieces for hours, even building this wood wall while the restaurant remained open. Now they're still a bit shaken up, but thankful that no one was injured. A scary sight Saturday in Stone Mountain as a car came crashing through this restaurant. It didn't seem real. We were just screaming. Everyone was screaming and the car the car just kept going. Lisa Myers is the owner of Fresca Trattoria, who watched this all unfold around three o'clock in the afternoon. It sounded like someone simultaneously hitting the gas and hitting the brakes, and there was just tremendous smoke because it was, I mean, you can see the tracks in there. It just dug through the, through the flooring. Leah Myers was serving the table of three, who dodged out of the way just in the nick of time before the car barreled through. I had a table sitting over there where the car ended up and they thankfully saw what was happening and moved themselves out of the way because the car then hit the table and pushed it. Tables, chairs and plates were run over while the window was smashed into glass. Shattering glass everywhere. I feel like you can still smell like the, the tire, like the burnt tire. As the car was towed away, the driver told Gwinnett County Police that her gas pedal stalled as her brakes failed unexpectedly. Now the cleanup is underway, and despite these tire tracks, the restaurant remains open. I made the pasta. We might as well be open. The kitchen's completely fine, so there's, there's no reason to close if we still have people that are willing to stick with us through the process. Until insurance steps in, Myers will be relying on community support to help her restaurant recover. The owner also added that the restaurant was robbed in April and that glass uh, window was smashed back then. Reporting live in Stone Mountain, Blake Devine, Atlanta News First.